this is Brendan Anderson with KDOL Sports, and we're here at Levi's Stadium after the final preseason game for the San Francisco 49ers. They finished their last game with a 23-13 win over the Los Angeles Chargers, finishing their preseason 2-2. Two and two. The 49ers were having problems moving the ball up the field in the first quarter tonight. They only had 15 yards of total offense after the first quarter. No, I wasn't. I mean, obviously during the game, you don't look at stats. You're not looking at anything like that. Um, the defense is doing a good job at turning the ball over and uh, getting turnovers, and uh, you know we end up scoring points. And it's, you know, some games don't go the way you want to at the beginning, and you just got to keep plugging away, and, and that's what we did, and end up, and get, end up getting the win. But it took quarterback C.J. Beathard on a 62-yard scamper in the second quarter to, to put the first touchdown points on the scoreboard. He led the team in rushing with 80 yards on the ground. Now I just felt a little bit of pressure up, up front and just saw an opening to the left and felt like I could get the first down and then the first down turned into more yards and, and it ended up being a touchdown after that. The Niners really won because of their turnovers. They ended up with five turnovers, with three interceptions and two fumble recoveries. Two of the interceptions were courtesy of Asa Jackson. He's a, he's a six-year veteran out of Cal Poly San Luis Obispo, and he got drafted in 2012 by the Baltimore Ravens. Talk a little about his play tonight. Yeah, I mean, from what I saw, he did a good job. You know, he I think he had the two picks. Um, but I saw him making a lot of tackles too, and you know, Ace is a guy that we brought here in the middle of the deal, and uh, he's brought some energy, plays hard, came in the middle of camp, does a good job in special teams, and um, I was excited about how he came here and helped us. So he's really trying to make a team here with the 49ers. He'd be happy to be out here and play in California, but really he just wants to make sure he makes an NFL roster. We got to talk to him a little bit after the game tonight. I wish y'all had the film because uh, me and Will Davis, that's a play that we jump all the time. And um, it's funny because they, the back was on one side and that play usually comes away from the back. So we looked at each other and so he was actually going to be the one that got the play. Then they flipped the back and we looked back at each other and right when I saw the release of the receiver, I knew what it was and, and just jumped it and was fortunate enough uh, to make the play. Oregon State rookie Victor Bolden had his second return in the preseason. He ran for 92 yards in the second quarter to put another touchdown on the board for the Niners. We got to talk to him after the game tonight. Out of your two uh, return touchdowns, do you think the first one was more important or the second? Because the first one kind of drew some attention to your name, the second one was like a follow-up, so you, can, you say you did it again. Um, I think they're equally important, you know, like like I said, uh, Coach Shanahan said that, you know, you can't got to take advantage of every rep. Every rep is equally as important, so uh, whether that's a walkthrough or a live game, so, you know, I feel like they're both the same. Kyle Shanahan is a week and a half away from his first NFL game as a head coach. Uh, I think it's good, you know, it's it's all about reps, and I was gl glad to get four of them before we start the real ones, and... Uh, you get more comfortable each time. I think the only time you're uncomfortable is a little bit of the unknown. I really and I had a looked at Carolina at all yet, but um, yeah, I know they're a good team. Got some good, talented players. Um, you know, we're excited to, to you know get into week one of the, of the regular season. This is Brendan Anderson for KDOL Sports at Levi Stadium, where the 49ers finished with a 23 to 13 win over the Los Angeles Chargers. Thank you for joining us tonight. We'll catch you on the rebound.